I believe off your reports you are out of gold. How could yeah. Gartman be out of gold? Well, let's, let's, I'm practicing social distancing in the gold market. Uh, it has become a little too crowded, and as uh, I think it was Yogi Berra who's, who was talking about a restaurant one time in New York who said nobody goes there anymore. It's too crowded. It's become awfully crowded. The boat has become very crowded. Too many people involved. I couldn't get people interested in gold uh, of consequence two and three years ago, and now it's front page well, news. Now it's the front page of every report that you see. It's the front page of magazines. It's the lead article on and, and the radio and television. And I think it's just become a bit too crowded. That's all. How much of a pullback do you need to see to become enthusiastic again? Well, first of all, there are, uh, let's say that I've always told people in a bull market there are three positions one can have, really long, modestly long, or neutral. And at this point on gold, I'm neutral. How far down do I think I need to see it go? Well, we're trading close to 1900, 1955, I think, just a few seconds ago. Uh, if we traded back to 1775 to 18 mm -hmm. and a quarter, mm -hmm. I'd be a buyer. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. And do I think that we'll get that kind of correction? Yes, I think we will. Do I, can I tell where, if it gets to 1775? Is that reasonable? I'll just simply say $100 from, from any interim high, and I'm a buyer again. What's the catalyst for a sell-off? Just the fact that the, the market is way too crowded, too many people involved, nothing more than that. Sometimes that's all one needs. You might see uh, a, a Fed become less accommodative, discussing perhaps a, a, a less expansionary policy towards its balance sheet. Some sort of comment from a federal official might do it. Uh, a, a turnaround in the dollar to a stronger dollar, which I don't think is going to happen, that might do it. A weakness in the stock market, that might do it. There's a number of things, but let's just simply say too many people are all, all of a sudden all involved in the, in the gold market. There's only one position that everybody has that's long, and I think that's just people have to be taken out of that trade. Dennis, Nothing weakness in the stock market causing a sell-off in gold. Does this mean that the correlation between gold and a risk-off feel in markets is broken? Well, it, it's interesting. Sometimes gold and stocks go up together. Sometimes gold and stocks go in contravention one to another. For the past several months, they've been moving in, in convention one with the other. As gold has gone up, so has stocks. As stocks has gone up, have gone up, so has gold. But I do think that there's a great probability that that conventional <clears throat> movement, that that consistency yeah. between the two shall, shall continue for a while longer. So if, if the stock market, <clears throat> and I think stocks are extremely expensive, if stocks start to tumble, you'll get a, mm -hmm. a, a, a correlative sell-off in the gold market. 